We at Revo International are undertaking the biodiesel fuel alternative to diesel oil, so-called sea fuel. Production business featured by utilizing used cooking oil. The trigger of such our business start was what our president, Tetsuya Koshikawa, encountered with one technology developed by a university professor while he was participating in a racing team. The turning point for our sea fuel business came in 1997 when Kyoto Protocol was decided by COP3 conference. At that timing, the city of Kyoto started the practical project of recycling used cooking oil from household to biodiesel fuel and utilizing it for public use vehicle. At that time, there was no other example of such an initiative being participated in both domestic and international scale. However, our project aims to play a bigger role in this initiative by educating the public and consistently supporting the collection and manufacturing of this fuel. And so, in 1999, Revo International Incorporated was established in order to make the real business of biodiesel fuel. Since then, we have been pioneering the industry of biodiesel fuel formed from used cooking oil. Now, we'll introduce our product, Sea Fuel, along with our business and future prospect. All over the world, the issue of reducing greenhouse gases, namely carbon dioxide emissions, is now becoming a serious subject. We believe that the use of sea fuel can contribute to resolving this problem. それを燃やしても、CO2の増加にはならない。で、それに対して普通の軽油の場合は、これは地下から取ってきて、それを燃やすんですから、CO2が出るわけですよね。その分、バイオディーゼル燃料っていうのは、CO2が本質的に少ない
by utilizing our original technology and know-how, accumulated for high quality and efficiency so far. In order to prove the quality and performance of sea fuel, we took on challenges that no one has undertaken before. The challenge we selected was motor racing, which required the most severe condition. Though during endurance circuits, the wheels move at a constantly high speed, we were able to complete the race without any engine trouble. In order to prove that our fuel can cope with extreme climates, we also took up the Dakar Rally Race, which is the most severe race in the world. The race starts in Lisbon in the middle of winter and finishes in the scorching deserts of Dakar. We were able to succeed as the fuel experienced no trouble despite the extreme environments and severe changes in temperature. This proves that sea fuel could achieve the fully enough level of quality to be deemed as diesel oil alternative. で、真ん中はちょうど良くてですね、3分の1は寒いんです。で、真ん中はちょうど良くてですね、3分の1は良くて、残りの3分の1はあの、皆さん信じられないですけど、本当に気温が50度を超えるんですよね。で、砂漠
This treatment does not require high temperatures or pressures which expend high energy, and there is no wastage of raw material during the recycling process. In addition, there is no discharge of wastewater. The glycerin byproduct is also used internally within the plant as a heat source. This treatment process is one of a kind in that it creates zero emissions. Now we'll introduce the manufacturing facilities developed by our company. We are able to handle various kinds of raw materials effectively. Thus, our company was commissioned by the Thai Petroleum Company, PTT, to design and manufacture biodiesel plants. This plant's design is based on the Kyoto factory in that it can produce fuel quality that's similar to large-scale factories. From here, sea fuel is being distributed to local companies and businesses. There are also small-scale plants for developing new technology and for experimental use. Such plants can be used as an educational tool for learning about the manufacturing process. We're promoting recycling businesses that can contribute to society by employing the techniques of manufacturing high-quality sea fuel biodiesel from used cooking oils. In Japan, it's said that there are 400,000 to 450,000 tons of used cooking oil produced every year. Unfortunately, of the used cooking oils discharged from households, over half are being disposed of as common waste. Also, over half of the used cooking oil discharged from commercial businesses, such as restaurants and shops, are being collected by recycling companies and turned into animal feed. Once incinerated, these resources will not be recyclable. And in the case of turning oils into animal feed? In this case, product quality and hygiene management, as well as food quality, is truly something to be emphasized. In reality, there are many problems with waste oil treatment being reported in other countries. Recycling oils in such a cheap and simplistic manner will only lead to further complications. We feel that recycling into sea fuel biodiesel is the best way to lower our carbon dioxide emissions. So, considering the benefits of this fuel source, we prioritize the collection of used cooking oil. As we receive more understanding and support, we're expanding our collection area from the Kinki regions to Tokai and Kanto areas. From now on, we will continue to collaborate with the government, business, and companies to provide a stable supply of sea fuel and contribute to the future of society. これは歴史が示している Biodiesel sea fuel is harvested from plant resources, and as such, it's a sustainable energy source. We've begun to undertake the challenge of researching into oil-producing plants to complement used oil collection, and thus creating a sustainable cycle from manufacture to distribution. We aim to have a plantation that's both environmentally friendly and does not have a negative effect on the agricultural industry. Through this project, we've promoted local growth and local distribution of sea fuel, which in turn 
enhances the economy of the area. Thus, this fuel has the potential to change the structure of societies that have been previously dependent on fossil fuels. Nowadays, popularization of biodiesel has taken place in many countries across the world. Also, the variety of plants being used in manufacturing continues to grow. Unfortunately, in Japan, this process is slowed due to legislation and difficulties in promoting the ideals of this system. In such a situation, our company is actively seeking demands from overseas in order to export. で、そんな中この安定供給を実績として実証してきてるのはやっぱり世界的にも私どもを当社しかないんですね。で、そういったところをご評価いただいた。また当社のこの工場を見ていただいて、ああ、なるほどということだと思います。ま、まずま、いうことでもその環境対策リサイクルということをテーマにしたま、地産地消型のエネルギーとしての循環を考えておりますで海外はやはり原料作物を作るこの地球上の太陽エネルギーを間接的に利用して成長して CO2を固定してそれで成長